Hi, welcome back to Otis and Piper. Today is Halloween and we are having a Halloween lesson where I'm dressing up Piper and myself. So I'm gonna show you how you can dress up your horse um, cheaply and easily. And please in the comments, let me know if you've ever dressed up your horse before. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. So for Piper's or Grandmom's nightgown, uh, I use my mom's nightgown here, and we're gonna have to do a little work to it. Uh, I'm gonna cut it down the back to open it up so that I can put it around Piper's neck, and I'm also gonna cut um, probably about two thirds of the way down here um, so that it doesn't go too low on Piper's legs. Um, and I'm gonna sew that the back of this so that it can reach around Piper's neck. So let's get started and see how it goes. So I cut off the bottom of the nightgown and I attached it right here on the side so that it can reach around her. Um, and then I'm going to cut off the access here and put Velcro so that I can attach it easily. And then I found this piece of fur from like a hood and I'm gonna put that inside here so she looks more like a wolf. So that'll be the nightgown part of it. For her gla granny glasses, I made them out of pipe cleaners. We should on her face just fine <laughs> and I'll attach them to her bridle when the time comes. Right now I'm using pipe cleaners to hook this wig onto her brow band and back of her bridle here so it will sit on top of her head like that. So the wing is pretty secure on there. I just have to hide the pipe cleaners. Just made this bonnet. I just wanted to measure it on her head. Looks good, but I just have to sew the elastic a little bit bigger and that should sit on top of the hair. 